Disney VHS. Does it sell on eBay? Let's have a look. Internet reports and news feeds have been saying for a while now that Disney VHS could be worth a small fortune. Is Disney on VHS worth money on eBay? This is what we're going to find out now. So is it true? Does Disney sell on VHS on eBay? Let me find out the truth. Let me do the research. Let me look at the facts on eBay at the current time I'm doing this. Let's do some research. Let's find out if Disney is worth money on VHS like they say. So we'll start with basic search, just Disney on VHS. Um, the current listings that everyone's put up. And we look like we've got uh, Jungle Book, Jungle to Jungle. Look, they're not going for much. They're Black Diamonds, I think. Yeah, $22, see? Not too much. There's another Black Diamond. That's coming for $2.95 and $30 postage. Um, I do have it worldwide. Uh, $36 There's another Black Diamond for the Lion King. That's understandable, but I still don't think they'll get that much. $22, zero bids for Bambi. Black Diamond as well, Black Diamond. So they're not going. So we just quickly scroll down really fast. $22, $8.33. And these are just all the current listings that people have put up. Uh, $22. And so these, are, these ones would be worth the $36 or go for the $50 because they are rare ones that you don't see all the time. Now it's funny how a lot haven't sold even at the cheapest price and apparently they're worth a fortune. <sighs> okay, so Alice in Wonderland. Look, Pinocchio, that's a black diamond as well. $7. Well, $50 postage. Jesus. So that's where they're trying to get their money. Uh, Japan one. All right, cool, cool. So you get the drift. Thirty-six dollars. That's fair price, I think. Maybe twenty dollars would be a more fair price. Uh, Peter Pan. That's Pocahontas. That's a black diamond. It's only five ninety-five. We'll buy it now for eight dollars. Come on. I don't like the idea of uh, when they don't put an actual photo and they've just put uh, a clip, a uh, shot from the internet. That's dodgy as fuck. Some more black diamonds, four of them. Five dollars, zero bids, forty-four dollars. All right, okay. So we get the drift there. People are dreaming. People are absolutely fucking dreaming. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna uh, all the newest, all the listings all together. Let's have a look what the highest price are that are for sale. Jesus Christ, is that? Am, am I right or wrong? Is that two million? Is that two fucking million dollars for all them? 29 people are watching it. You are got to be kidding me. Two million. Two million. People are fucking dreaming. Fucking dreaming. There's a million. million dollars for three black diamonds. Look at that. Fucking dreaming, mate. 44,000. 12 are watching. Jesus. No wonder these uh, news news shows and the media and all that are freaking oh these are going to be worth a fortune these are going to be worth a fortune no one's actually buying them though all right so you get the drift there they're black diamond ones people are dreaming about selling these black diamond ones expensively but uh 29 watching for this fourteen thousand dollar little mermaid look at that band art cover well let's have a quick little look at that because what's banned about it I don't... Ah, oh, yeah. This is the one that's meant to look like a cock. So that's meant to be a cock. Right near uh, King Triton's hand. That's a cock. That's... Okay. Band cover. That's fucking stupid. Let's see what the lowest ones are going for. And it looks like the lowest ones have got 99 cents and $4 postage. It costs you $8 to post one of these. They're too heavy. This one's free shipping. $5 for the Lion King. Someone was selling it for 1000 
Dumbo, Pete's Dragon, $2, $5 postage. I don't know how they afford to do $5 postage. That's a good price for one of those classics there. The, uh, that's, that's, that's a pretty good price, $3. Yeah, look, $8 free postage, $8 free postage. This is why you got to research these before you buy them, because pff, this is just, uh, that's, a, that's ridiculous. You're going to make no money. You'll make 99 cents, because that's how much it costs. Eight fifty-five to post. All right. Okay, so that was just listings. Let's see what's actually sold on eBay. So we'll put in the current sold. Okay, ended recently. Now we're going to do what has sold recently. Parent Trap went for $36. Parent Trap for the little ginger kibs. And this Classics one went for $6. See, these ones I don't trust. When there's a line there, you don't know how much this person paid for them. So fuck them. We're not going to add that in. Just wait for this plane to go over. Pluto. That one's alright, $11, but you don't know how much they actually took for it because there's a line through it. Look, all those black diamond ones there, all those black diamond ones went for $19. $41 postage, that would have only cost $20 postage. You fucking crooks. Okay. Hmm. What the hell is that? Mouse size? Okay, $73 for all those black diamonds. $8 for the rescuers. Eight dollars for sword and stone, but in broomsticks. Look, black diamond, fucking nineteen eighty nine, one dollar eighty four for that little mermaid one, and people have got it for thousands and thousands of dollars. It's a fucking joke. Pluto tails. See, that's more, in my opinion, one of the rare ones. Definitely, in my opinion, Pluto tails is more of a rare one than these black diamonds because they're harder to find. Uh, what's that? Is that Legend of the Sleepy Hollow? Yeah, it is. Thirty-two dollars. That's pretty good price there. That'd be hard to find that one. Tiger Town, that would be uh, hard to find as well. 22, don't know what they ended up paying for that. $8 for all those black diamonds, look at that. And $50 postage, you crooks. It's looking about right, it's looking about, it's looking about okay. Uh, let's put from high to low and see what has actually sold for the highest on uh, eBay. Instead of all these rumors on the internet about thousands and thousands let's actually have a look and see if someone has actually paid what we'll do is we'll have a look at the highest postage of what people have actually paid and received little mermaid out of print got eleven thousand um, dollars i'm doubting it a little bit basil the great mouse detective was the highest sold there 88 dollars postage fuck off that would have cost fucking eight dollars fifty five fourteen dollars $14, $14,000, $5,000 for Cinderella, this one, Black Diamond, Cinderella, $4,000, see, bidded, but doesn't mean they actually paid, like this, three blank tapes with cartoons on it, 18 bids, $2,988, doesn't mean they actually paid, Sleeping Beauty, $2,800, what did they pay for it, it's got a line in it, these ones, these first three do look legit. Lucky, lucky, lucky break for them. A lot of seven, don't know what they paid. They're asking for 2,600. These ones went, four of them went for 2,200. Okay, so about four or five were confirmed for sales over a grand. This is maybe where the news feed are getting all their information from, but if it was done by, if it was sold by your um, uh, auction, doesn't mean they paid. I, I don't take that bullshit. Don't listen to that bullshit. Aladdin, that went $2,213, but it's got a line through it, which means they got an offer accepted. Did not pay that. Black Diamond, Alice in Wonderland, $1,000. This bid here doesn't mean they actually paid. This one here, line in it, doesn't mean they paid. So I call this all bullshit, like this. One bid, doesn't mean they actually paid for it. Because this is what happens when you do biddings, that's why you just have buy it now, don't do biddings. One thousand, one bid, let's go down to reality. Sixteen sealed, unopened. 
295 I can believe that. Especially if they're not opened. $140 postage, you crook. You fucking crook. Look at all those. 123 of them. 123 of them. Jesus. And they only charged $82 for postage. That would have cost actually probably more. Hmm. So, it all speaks for itself. There's some, uh, that actually looks like some uh, good ones. They got a good value there. They have some, um, they're not the classic classics. They're, uh, the white covers though. That's pretty cool. Cap and Kappa. What the fuck? Little Mermaid. Yeah, look. Half of these are bullshit. Half of these are absolute bullshit. Mickey. These people have overpaid. People have overpaid. Welcome to Pooh Corner. <laughs> $184. It's a scat loving, uh, scat loving Walt Disney video, that one. Ah, Jesus Christ, the sing alongs. Now, I know the uh, Song of the South is worth money because uh, they didn't even, I don't even think they put that zippity doo dah shit on a fucking DVD because they said it was racist because he was a slave or something. But uh, zippity doo dah. Alright, you get the drift. You get the drift, but uh, the majority are uh, cheap ones that sell. So what do you think? So I think a thumbs down if you think you're gonna get rich from VHS Disney tapes. So in the end, some classics will score you about between $10, $15, uh, black diamonds mainly. They're not gonna go for thousands, but you will get about 10 bucks. Sealed black diamond VHS uh, Disney tapes, you will probably get 100 bucks or more maybe. Um, hit and miss. Uh, you may get thousands if you get some real dumbass that thinks they're worth so much money because of all these news reports, but you're looking at hundreds if they're sealed. If they're sealed. So my verdict is, yes, they do sell on eBay, but do your research and buy cheap. And when I say cheap, I mean 50 cents to a dollar each. Make sure you do your research and don't get suckered in to these idiots that are trying to sell. They're Disney VHS, more than $10 to $20. Don't get suckered in. I've personally been successful with Disney tapes um, of selling them on eBay, but most of them go for about $10 to $15, like I said, and just like the, the page shows you. I only had one rare one once. It was Bigfoot movie. Disney Bigfoot movie. It was a TV movie that went for $50, and that was pretty rare. And the most I could get was $50. So don't overpay and don't get sucked into all this social media bullshit about how they're worth a fortune. It's all bullshit. It's all bullshit. They mustn't have any stories or anything to post, so that's the best they could come up with for the news that week. So like I said, the verdict is a yes, they do sell on eBay, but uh, don't let your expectations uh, think you're going to get thousands and thousands of dollars. Buy cheap, buy cheap, 50 cents to a dollar, and you're gonna get 10 to $15 uh, profit, which is awesome. That's still awesome. But once again, like I said, make sure you do your research, because there's a lot of titles, like your Toy Stories, and things like that, that just don't move, because there were so many of them, so many of them that were for sale and sold, because they were one of the highest selling VHS's of all time, Lion King, because that's another one of them. Uh, thanks guys, cheers for watching, click like, subscribe, uh, and uh, yeah, watch the other videos that I've uh, done where I've go thrifting and find videos. Cheers for watching, see you next time. See you.